the quarterbacks uh, leave a, a lot to be desired, I think, for, for this NFL draft. That doesn't necessarily mean none of them are going to pan out. None of them are going to be star quarterbacks. We've seen it happen before. Guys, you know, second, third, sixth round go on to be Hall of Famers. But no quarterbacks in your top ten. Take us through the three potential first-round picks in Willis, Pickett, and Corral. Well, yeah, I, I think there's not going to be, at this point, a quarterback inside the top 10 because we will see some movement on the veteran quarterback market that will take away some of those quarterback needy teams sitting inside the top 10, Carolina Panthers being one of them. Malik Willis landing with the Washington Commanders. There's just such an easy tie to Ron Rivera and Marty Herney and their time spent with Cam Newton. Now, Malik Willis is not a Cam Newton prospect. He's a lot smaller than Cam Newton, but stylistically what he's capable of, his strengths are actually very similar to Cam Newton. So I can see Ron Rivera having a liking for Malik Willis and they need a quarterback in that roster in Washington. Kenny Pickett is probably the most week one ready quarterback in this draft class. And the Saints have to do something at that position. We don't know, are they going to go with a veteran? Do they want to go with a rookie? But they need to infuse more talent into that quarterback spot that, of course, after Drew Brees retired, was kind of a disaster this past season. And then Matt Corral landing in Pittsburgh with Mike Tomlin Steelers. I think it's time for the Steelers to enter this new era in the AFC of quarterbacks that are athletic, that can throw the football deep down the field. Ben Roethlisberger, Hall of Fame career, but they need a quarterback that's more in trend with what the Joe Burrow, the Justin Herbert, Josh Allen, and Patrick Mahomes type quarterbacks are doing on the field on Sundays. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.